Hi, coach. Sir. Hello, Hi. coach. Yeah, Hello, coach. Uh -huh. How you can hear that? I don't hear anything. Hi, coach. Can you hear me? No, no, I cannot. Wait. You hear me now? Yeah, yeah, I can. But I cannot hear you. Not, I'm not connected. You need to put in something. Right. Uh, Uncle, tell something. Yeah, yeah, I can hear you. Good. No, no, I know. Yeah. Need it? You just put it. Yeah. Wait. Uncle, yeah, yeah, I can hear you. Oh no, I not, I cannot wait. Some problem we have. Now you see something. Now you, talk. Now you talk. Sir. What? Now you talk. No, no. Ah. Uh, I, I cannot not hear you at all. I, I hear can. You can hear me. Bit, but I cannot hear of the headset. No. But coach, everyone can listen you, I think. Wait a moment. Connect it to the audio. Ankush, one minute, uh, we'll uh, log off and we'll come back. Yeah, we'll yeah.
Which you can hear me? Yeah, yeah, I hear you. You can uh, me now? Yeah, yeah, we can start. We change uh, headset. Okay. Can yes, start. Yeah. You can start. Oh, okay. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to the one more day of the of the clinic. As I say yesterday, I will try to speak about uh, orphans, and I uh, decide to speak about read react. Read react is uh, we cannot say that he is one. Uh, one uh, motion offense. That is, uh, for uh, some offense, uh, uh, for uh, some offense that is, uh, you need a good five intelligent player, multiple player, and uh, with a, a read react, you don't need uh, to have uh, this top level of the player, but also if you have, that is very good. Uh, also, they are not depend on the certain type of the player. That is, uh, some player will be much better. Some no, you can you can involve all of them in a system. That is also not offensive set inside another offensive set. Is uh, pretty something uh, what is uh, special on for our own self. That is uh, some frame framework that uh, you can you can play that is uh, like what we are said uh, we are we are make a big picture and then put in a, in a parts and after that uh, after that back to the back to the big big picture to set up to know how working to organize and to put these coaching points as we as we talk uh, as we talk uh, before. Uh, also, what is interesting? Uh, can you put Ankur's uh, goal for a read, re read react? Goal for a read react. Ankur. Okay. Goals. Goals for a read react. E uh, one of the one of the fix for a read react is uh, that uh, is easy to teach. And uh, also easy to be transformed from a coach to coach. Easy to be uh, transformed from a coach to the player. Easy to be master through repetition. Like everything, what's a need? You are need repetition, correction, and that is uh, this offense give a great opportunity that you can do. This offense build a habit of the player. Habit to player to pass to cut, to penetrate, to make a screen, and then to keep, keep good spacing. But don't need a very high IQ. Give a good freedom for a player. And then this offense, no mistake. When you are making mistake, you have to continue. That is not a problem. That is a system what is a build up around five main coordination. That everyone have to see the moment front of him to see the ball and to follow this what need to do. Very simple for a kids, but also complex, uh, completed and then complex for a, enough for a pro player. Because uh, I can tell you, I, I play this with a with a senior team, and usually I I not using. Uh, middle part of the game but i using usually in the beginning beginning and then i use use at the end because every player need to keep the spacing and to follow penetration it's very good very good to build the fundamentals of the player that is uh let the player that everybody we have to be involved they have to run and then build up uh, really, really uh, build up uh, fundamentals of the player. Flexibility of the offense. You can see here. That is, don't need a certain type of the player that you are looking for a special player, but you are need to play. Team with a not post player, 5-0. You will take 5-0 
pass and cut everything you what you will see after that and then team what have a strong post player you can play with a strong player that is a 4 1 or that you are put some player in a moment that coming later on if you have a team with a small quick guard you can play very good deliberate the team that give you opportunity five out four four out three out they can play with a high post mid post low post we can play with a screen or play without the screen that give you certain certain opportunity and then that is you have a habit definition what's meaning basketball is a ball uh, is a game of the habit we are build up the habit from the first day we we need to build the habit of the player then player need to read a ball and then after that when they read the ball they have a they have a reaction a reaction on the this that is a set read and react and then also this offense when we are say that cannot be mistake can be mistake but we will ignore it make mistake and we we continue that is uh, this will increase the confidence of the player and in this offense they are not to put a player that have to think too much they are put a player that need to react if your player less thinking they have a more opportunity more opportunity for a habit player with the instinct that is uh, very important that is a uh, key for a reaction every player watch basketball that all player that is what we are teach a player maybe from a nine player on the court that is uh, we include the defender player only only player all uh, every player have to see the ball player in the defense also have to see the ball but he can see only one player who is on the ball but actually every player on the on the court have to see ball and that is uh, something what uh, good position of the read react they are push you that you can uh, that you can read uh, read the basketball and then react on the on the this one that is a reaction on the ball moment if your ball is a pass or a ball penetrate we need we need uh, to react all reaction is a reaction of the single moment of the basketball and uh, only can be trained for a one specific reaction and then for a specific moment that is a big advantage of the read react but now we are going for an example uh, to better understand what we are what we are tell first whole part method and after that we will make on the part big big whole method that have a real real read react they have a 70 layers but to good understand first six layer is a dominate dominate layer layer that is a pass pass to cut, pass and cut that is a pass uh, pass to the big guy and cut third one is a, a dribbling dribbling re replacement and uh, four fifth and six is a reaction is a circle movement that's meaning when ball start to penetrate how other players have to react uh ankush can that is the first six after that from a six seven eight till 17 that is a uh, advanced level but we will use some something from uh, this advanced level level uh today uh ankush can you give a first okay give a give a this picture before also to people see how look like that is uh that is uh, how look like uh read react that that is uh you have from every part you have a lot of lot of dvds or uh, all all package of the of the read react and then that is the first three layer what i talking about you will see this uh, these three layers okay can you show the first picture is a pass and cut that is first one that is uh, their care north south that meaning when i pass on the 45 if you are cut that meaning north south and then when you are going 
over the baseline is uh, is uh, east west. Okay, that is a picture where explained where you can see and you can you can now now download it that you have more idea about uh, read react. But we are going now on the on the video of the read react. Okay. That is a passing cut. A live version of this drill. Give the defense points for every deflection or steal they get. Give the offense points for every layup that's made. Play to a specific score or play against time. That's up to you. You might have to skew the points toward the defense in order to make them go after the steals and deflections. Something like Give the offense one point for layups and the defense three points for a deflection or still. No dribbles are allowed unless it's needed to complete a layup. Okay, stop, stop now, stop now. Stop. Okay. Uh, what you are seeing on the court, you can see number five. Number five, number five, number five. That is a five spot. When we, when we say that we are playing, five five out and that is a five spot where is a five out or three three out two in also is the same like uh, five out five out we have one player on the top two player on the side and two player in a in a in a corner that's meaning that meaning is a five five outside five outside player and then uh, position four, four, four. That is have a four, four position plus two corner. What is uh, what is uh, uh, what is also position when we play, but that is a reverse position. When we have a dribbling replacement and something, that is a position where player can go. But actually, what is the different four and five? That is you have a middleman and one player on the top. But when we are playing with uh, with uh, four people, we have a uh, two people, two people on the on the top, and then a little bit spacing is uh, more more wider. Okay, you can you can start with the video. Pass, cut. Pass. have to come uh, can you can you switch uh, voice Ankush, switch your voice player when player pass and cut immediately player from a stop now look player from a weak side have to replace his position by sprint they have to come to the disposition go let it let it go and then everybody will coming, coming and occupy it all. Yeah, pass, cut, and then immediately somebody have to replace. That is the first one of the most important layer. And then, uh, can you stop? I will. I will explain on the board. I think you are cut on the on the on the wrong way. That is. I will, I, I will explain on the board. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, okay. We have, we have a five position. We have a five position, five player. Five player. And then when player pass the ball, he have to cut, but he need to cut till, till the end. And then in the same time, player have to replace his position. He is moving and he is now cut to the basket. Immediately, player from a weak side need to replace his position. Another player have to replace. And player what's a hot cut now will go in a, in a free position. Now, we will again occupy, occupy all position. That is. And then, now, 
this player is with the ball. And then he can pass here or he can pass here. When player pass here, that is immediately time that he will cut front or the back cut and the same player from a weak side have to full, have to full, have to full position. That is, uh, that is uh, first principle of, of pass and cut. Again, if we have a four and one, we said we have a four position plus two reverse, re, reverse position. That is, that is the main, and this two is a helping position. Pass and cut till here. In the same moment, we need to replace. We need to replace. We are not going to the man. We are going by sprint to the position. After that, you will see that will give you opportunity that we can go, we can go to the, that we can go to the basket. I want to see on the video that is, I think uh, Ankush, uh, Ankush didn't, didn't cut on the right way, pass and cut. He take a wrong sample. Okay, you will see here. That is, go, go, go. See, player coming. That is a very important point. That is another. Uh, read line. Stop, and then I will explain a read line. You have a situation. Stop it. And come back to the, this one. Not from the beginning. Red line. You have to see what's meaning red line. Uh, put on the, on the, look, look here. That is the meaning. When I see they're my defender, it's a show can, that I cannot receive the ball and I see his neck. For me, it's a time to go to cut. Immediately, that is a that is a rare cut or backdoor cut, and then player with the ball is here, and then he step over the over the line. We are called a, a red line, and then that is a me immediately moment that I have to cut, and then when I cut from a this position, that he can change, he can pass to the another side and go cut cut to the basket. That is. A, that is uh, what what very important. See the player; they are coming over the three-point line. You are need to cut. Go. You will see now. Go. Put put the video. Back. See here, that is a player coming up, want to deny, that is bad. That is a passing cut. Player pass, cut to the spot under the basket, and they have to continue. Pass, cut, replace, and then player have to find a way where is the open spot, and have to go to the right, to the right side. Pass, cut, and then everybody replace. That is a four and one. And then that is a reverse, a reserve position that he have to go. He has to go on the opposite side. And then again, we will have a good balance. Keep continue, keep continue. That is player with the ball, and then another pl player have to react to find uh, to find a way. He did everything. What are you doing now?
Okay, go to the lair tool. You are you are missing this one. Okay, show me picture. Show me first picture. First one, not this one. Picture up, 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 up. Layer one. Yeah, okay. Okay. Layer one. If you if you can see here, that is a little bit, little bit is uh, is a uh, small, but you can see player five player is uh, around around perimeter. And then when player pass, they need to need to cut from the opposite side. Where is a free player have to replace him. Pass, cut, replace. And then player was cut under the basket, have to read and need to go to the open area. I will repeat this one more time on the on the on the board. That is, we have a five player here, player with the ball, and then when player pass, he will cut. And then again, player from a weak side, from a opposite side, they will replace, they will replace. Player under the basket. Now, have to read where is the free. Free is here, and then he will come in. That is what we are saying first. That is, read, react is a two players, two players, they are re react, and five other players, they are re react around this, these two players. If in a situation we have, that is, ball on the top, ball on the top, and then in this moment, the player close and not allowed the player to receive the ball, player immediately have to full to cut to the basket, and player from a corner immediately have to come to the disposition for a possible, possible re receiver for a pass. That is the one of the most important part of the read react because they will give you opportunity that you will that you will move. Go to the layer two. First picture, and after that uh, picture. That is uh, pass to the center and cut. That is the same situation. I think that is that cannot see very good, but I will explain. After that, we will we will going over the we will going over the over the video. That is center is here, and then we are four and one. For example, if you player pass to the wing and then cut to the opposite side, they will replace from the opposite side. Another two players, they will replace. One will come in here, one player will come in here. In this moment, when we are passed to the big guy, that we have a two opportunity. One is, uh, they are called Lakers cut. That is a cut here, or cut, cut through, the, through the baseline. That is a two cut, what we have, and they are called Lakers cut. When we are given, to the low post. Same story is uh, when we are given to the high post, it's the same story. Lakers cut up and Lakers cut, cut down. Little bit around, we have to make uh, eye contact and after that, we have to, to, pass, uh, to pass the ball. Okay, Ankush, you can go to the video. on the perimeter. But if the passer has teammates to the right and left, as in the case of a guard feeding the high post, then the direction of the... That is what I say. On the this direction, player will cut. You see, pass, this direction, will be replaced. Pass, cut. And then immediately we will, we will, uh, we will follow. I explain low post, you can see now it's a, it's a high post. That is also important in situation when we are playing four and one or three, two, four outside and one inside player that we can, that we can do, do, uh, this moment.
Okay. Uh, we will going to the third one. Is a is a circle movement. Circle circle movement. Uh, no. Uh, another one is a, uh, dribbling. 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 If your player not move, that we are dribbling to him, and then player have to cut cut to the basket. That is a, that is a reaction. Go, go, uh, show number three. You can download these three. Player on the same way, they are staying. Player on the same way, I will show again on the board. Player on the same way, they are staying, not moving. And then I cannot pass, I cannot penetrate, I cannot pass to the other side. I will dribbling, speed dribbling to the player. And in this moment, player have to cut to the basket. That is... Uh, reaction that is a reaction on the dribbling and then immediately we will fool from uh, from the opposite side we are pull and player what's cut have to have to full position on the court okay go show with us Dribble at. You see, player dribbling to him, cut. Dribbling to him, cut. And then everybody, everybody replace from a weak side. Dribbling to the right, people from a left side, they will, they will replace. Look, here. Player stay. They can. He is in some way staying. I will dribbling to him, and then player will cut immediately. Pass, and then that is uh, this three layer. What we are say, we can start to playing basketball with the three. Look back, and then that is all time we are provocate back door, back door, back door, or pass and cut. Really, with these two, we can pretty good, pretty good, pretty good play. Dribbling to you, you are immediately cut. And then after that, you will see combination between, between these three layers. There is a pass, cut, and a combination of these three. You will see now from a big side player coming and full it. We are in a in a situation four out, one one in. That is combination. That is pass, cut, give to the center. Combination, these three layers, what we are what we are talking. One, two, three. Pass, cut, dribbling at and the back door. That is pass to center. That is high cut. Five outside. Pass cut. Pass cut. Dribbling, back door. Dribbling, back door. Dribbling, fool it. And now you can see that is an option when they are offense and defense. Who will make more points? That is a game situation. We are back from a part method. Now we bring a defense and then 
execute very very fast what is uh, what is uh, read react what uh, give us opportunity they give up opportunity that offense need to follow individual player 90% 90% to follow I, when we are talking defense 90% follow player with the ball and they are forget forget to help that is the quality of the read react when you have to follow your man all time who is all time move move in this moment you have a, you have to problem to recognize your player and after that they will come in penetration now you see we only have uh, these three things what we are saying that is a pass cut dribbling at back door and then we have a pass pass to the high post mid post and then cut around them on the same way to develop our movement without the ball is very good to develop our fundamentals that is very good very good uh, very good way and then you will see now now when is the pass you will see when is the pass to the to the high post what what way i can i can do there there give opportunity also all the time i have to care where is the defense that i use use a good uh, good pass that is enough come to the high post this is a deep keep it from here that is a dribbling dribble ed because i can dribbling also to the big guy but big guy have to find a way can you stop in this moment ankur stop it please and then i will explain on the board you have a three level where big guy can cut we have a high post we have a high post we have a mid post and we have a short corner and then in a moment when i dribbling to him he can go down to open or he will going to the short corner and then you will see that is a continuity other player will open open that is a circle moment that is a coming layer four circle moment they will have to be open from above you will see now go go with them continue that is a very good example because also i can dribbling to the big guy and then big guy have to find a way where have to go outside player will cut to the basket but when i dribbling to the big guy he has he has a you can see these spots or slot they have to go that have a high post mid post they have to be open to open and then they can receive the ball that he can be a possible threat where he will receive the ball on the possible on the possible dribbling that is and you see other player they are move that can uh, that is a circle circle movement that is a layer four you will see what will be happen and player what is a big guy have to be open not to be close with the defender he have to find open line but this line will help him what what need what need to do and then also this movement of him they will open another player that can penetrate till the basket you see he attack this spot and then when he move if your defense not react player will continue and going going to score that what we are what we are say player need to follow to keep very good spacing and to have a reaction on penetration one more time your movement that is the movement between two, two player 
and all other players have to react on the this. That is everything what we are what we are saying uh, before. Okay, Ankush, uh, go to the to the next next layer, layer uh, layer four. Circle circle uh, circle movement. That meaning when we are penetrate, I explain on the board. When we are penetrate, how players have to react on the penetration. It's a not same reaction when we are penetrate from a top and it's uh, different when we are penetrate from a side. If we have uh, this situation, that is, if I penetrate this way, this player have to go in a corner, this player have to cut to the basket and player from a weak side have to fool it, have to fool it position that we are come back come back in a, in a good good space and good good balance that is uh, if your penetration happen from uh, this this side if penetration happen from the side and we have a player here that is why we are called circle movement i penetrate here and this moment this player will show me here this player will show me here and this player will go here that is player from a uh, opposite side we are called safety value and then he need to help me if you any problem that that he will be safety person that i cannot do anything and then we will pass to him and we will continue that is uh, dribbling is uh, today very important part of the game and then this uh, this layer is the one of the most important. But then this layer is layer number five and layer number six because we have also in the layer number six you will see penetration for a corner and then a reaction on the, this penetration. Okay, go. Video. drives to the rim, what I refer to as north-south dribble penetration. Okay. You see now? That is what I, what I write. Dribbling here, everybody will move for an extra spot. That is a four and one. Different. That is four and one. That is a, a, a reserve position in a corner. And again, we have a very good balance. Circle movement. See, everybody like a circle, opposite from a penetration, they have to move. See. Everybody need to see the ball. That is number one, when we are talking. That is a situation that we will not make in a collision. We don't want. And then see, defense help immediately. We are make a good spacing that somebody will be free. Defense going opposite of us, want to help. We are going opposite from a help of the defense that we have a good spacing. That is the one in a modern basketball most important, uh, most important part of the game. And that is defense not help. I go and score under the basket, and I will go score. Defense not help. If you defense help, somebody will be free, and then, and then we will score. Keep to go. You will see. Defense help. Yeah. Defense help. Pass. Open shot.
and that is not easy to teach. Look, look at this. That is on penetration. They are player cut, and then every of them that is a possible possible receiver. Every of them possible receiver. Look, that is from a corner, and then we can play in a situation five out, four one, three two. Just different rules with the big guy. Big guy have a have a different rules. When go down, when go up. Uh, look, everybody is uh, close, and that is a man who is a uh, safety value. We are talking about. Can you stop? Can you stop? Uh, in this moment, in this moment. I will going to penetrate. Player from here, they will open me here. Player from here, they are going here. Player from a corner, they will cut to the basket. Player from a corner, I told this, he will coming up and he is a safety for me. If your player try to double, double here or help recover, I cannot pass. To the open man, I will make a pivot and pass to the player. And then, safety value behind the back of the ball. You can read it. Safety value behind the ball. That is a player what is circling. And then, that is all time. If you are proper movement, we have a, we have a player who will, be, who will be in this position. Continue. Keep it. And that is a penetration. Very, very important part of uh, read react that is uh, from a four and one that is safety value when penetrate stop and then after that we have to be open that we can give and that is the percentage how we, we have to organize that we are we have a very good base continue continue Penetration need to read defensive reaction. How defense react? In this moment, defense helps too much and then pass coming to the, to the free player. That is the quality of the read. Can you stop? Stop, wait. That is the quality of the read react. They are give movement of the player, give you opportunity that you are improved. Everybody move. That is uh, Coach Zoran talk and I talking now. If we play zone, the quality of the player, movement of the player, will be very poor because all player is close in the zone. And yesterday we are talking about option that you are play uh, that play puck line defense, and then from a puck line defense you are in a man to man, and then movement of the player will give you a lot of opportunity. Okay, go, keep keep going. See, number two, go to help and immediately player fine and player is free. And that is what I say again, repeat. Five on zero, four on zero, and now layer, layer uh, number six. Layer number six, that is uh, from a corner. That is a uh, dribbling for a corner is a little bit different because that is when we are, we have a, for example, this, this situation. And then, uh, principle of the read react. If I dribble here, everybody have to move on the other side. But baseline is a little bit different. Baseline patient is a little bit different. If you player penetrate from, uh, from, from a base, Every time we talking yesterday, one of the most stronger shots in the basketball is a corner three. Corner three is one of the high percentage shots in basketball. Over team is over 45%. And then when we are talking about penetration for a corner, we had a this position from the beginning. What we will do? 
In this moment, this player stay in a corner. He will not move the corner. He will be in a corner. Player with the ball penalty. In this moment, this player is a safety player. We call, if you anything happen, this player is a pivot and then have an opportunity to can give to the, this player. This player will open opportunity for him and then this will give opportunity. We, we call this open window. Open window for a player that can pass. Or if you are playing in a formation four and one, four and one, corner penetration. For example, we have a center on the this side and that is the same story what we have a three, three spot, one spot, second spot and third spot for a big guy. If I penetrate here, that is immediately, I need to have a player here. Center immediately will open up, will open up to help me that his player cannot stay. And then he will be here up open and then player from this side, they will open me like a safety value. If anything wrong happen, and then player from here will open window for me. In the same situation, if your center is opposite, if you are on the opposite side, and I penetrate from a corner, center have to give me opportunity that I can pass to him. I have an open corner again, and then this player have to a little bit go on. That is open window that I can pass and then every, every player will be see the ball and then move in a position that in this moment they can help. That is uh, why we are talking about uh, dribbling. Today, dribbling creates everything in a basketball. And then read, react in a combination. What we are talking about, pass and cut, dribbling in, pass to the big guy. That is uh, circle movement. And then last goal, last one, what we are, what we are saying, that is uh, this layer, uh, baseline penetration. We have all time to have a good spacing, to be ready to cut. And then, again, what I told, you can make a mistake. Immediately, if your mistake happen, player have to recognize, pass to another place. We will keep position and we are continue. That is uh, flexibility of the flexibility and quality of the read react is uh, very big uh, show this layer continue by uh, by video what's well, not a baseline try if you drive to the goal from the okay you see that is, a, that is a baseline penetration. That is a baseline penetration, four and one. Three out, two in, baseline penetration. After that, you will see reaction on the this penetration. Look, stop, stop now. I didn't explain this. Stop, 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 stop. I didn't explain, I will explain. That is a curiosity of the read react. Because when somebody penetrates under the free throw line extended, under the free throw line extended, and then we have a, this situation, and then player is in a corner, and I penetrate, this player needs to stay in a corner. And then everything else that is, uh, we need to have a corner player, we have to have open window, we have to have a center up or center to the opposite side that will be open. And then this player from a corner, if you continue, we never want to help from a corner. That is the reason. If you help from a corner immediately from the beginning, they will happen shot from a three point. And then that is some curiosity of, the, of the, this one. In this moment, corner men not to move. Like opposite side, they have to be in a corner. Same, if to 45 penetration, their corner men have to stay. Okay, you will see this. Continue. Ankush.
same way. That is, immediately we have to have a player in a corner. I will take this way. You see, after that, we have an opportunity where we can pass from this penetration, opportunity where we can pass. How players have to follow baseline penetration. Baseline drive, how we will follow, corner, Look, center will coming up. That is uh, 45 opposite side and corner, corner that can be passed. Look, center up, everybody catch. Penetration, corner man, and then that was with a three, three, two. But we need to cover. We stretch the floor and cover the floor. We not let the defense that can react. I beat defense, I score. And then defense have to rotate in a, all this situation. Keep it to go. See, corner, open, and say safety value player behind me. Passing cut, post dribbling it, circle moment, and then post slide. That is uh, all what we are talking, what we are talking till, till now. That is center reaction. Center reaction for a ball side, center reaction on the weak side. You see? That is the three in, uh, three out, and two in. That is 5 0. Corner man, safety value, receive the ball, take a three point shot. And then we'll, uh, we'll talk about some curiosity of the read react. You will see now. Look. Player not going up, he need to stay in a corner. That is a curiosity. Dribbling from a, you will see. Dribbling, center high. That is a three spot for a big guy. We need to have a corner up and then save, save TV value. That is a call natural pitch and then player from a top have to come in a corner. And we are practiced so much with the senior team. If you are asked, uh, you have an assistant here. You can ask that every day we are, we are working because that, is, that must be automatism of the player. Players have to know when they wake up, they need to know where they have to stay. They are called spacing, and players very good need to know everything about this. Okay. Uh, I will finish. I prepare. Uh, I pre prepare. That is a ball screen. You you can uh, you can also is a reaction on the ball screen. That is a power dribbling, power dribbling handoff, and uh, but we don't have a time today. That is a power dribbling. That is a handoff from a power dribbling. Is a very similar of the this one. And the last one is a screen away. That is L cut or screen away. But uh, now we don't have a time for uh, this. And then uh, you can see, you can find, uh, you can find, you can, uh, you can make a picture of this and search. Have a lot of material in the uh, in, uh, internet, WhatsApp and other other material that is everything about uh, about read react offense very popular offense what what i said very very complex and uh, good for a
pro player. I said as a coach, I use the read react, especially in the beginning of the fast break or end of the offense that my player need to make a spacing. Very simple, very good to give up from a coach to coach, from a coach to the player. They are developed very good uh, fundamental. Uh, they are, they are uh, developed, developed player, habit of the player. is a not very big uh, IQ. And then what is, uh, what is easy? You can play with a five outside player. You can play if you, if you don't have a big eye. You can put somebody on the disposition. If you are very fast, fast team, you can use with a lot of, lot of, lot of high, lot of cuts. If you want to use a screen, you can use it with a screen because I explain only six layer, but from a seven till 17, you have a lot of opportunity. Big size screen, you have a ball size screen, you have a handoff, you have this L cut screen away. And then in this combination, that is a very, very, very good. And then give a great su success that you can play. But player have to see the ball and react on the ball. Thank you very much for uh, your, your time today. And then I hope uh, that we will see see you next time. We, we have uh, two more sessions. I will be here. And then you can ask a question and everything what, what you are need. Thank you very much. Any questions can raise their hand. Vijay, Vijay, you can ask. Vijay. Kamal, you can ask your question. Yes, sir. Good evening, sir. Uh, so, uh, we were going through the read and react. So, I noted down the first layer is pass cut, second is post pass, dribble act, four yeah. circle move. And what about the layer five? I couldn't get to. Can you explain layer five? Uh, let, uh, layer five, we didn't explain. That is a uh, reaction, reaction of the big guy on the penetration. And I didn't want to involve too much inside player. I didn't want to in, in, involve inside player. That is the center, reaction of the center. But you are in the layer six, you see reaction of the center. If I, from a top dribbling to him in the layer three, I, I show this. If I dribbling to the big guy, he has a three position where he can go. He has high post. From a high post, he will going down. And if you are coming from a 45 and dribbling down, center will going up. And then that, that, that will be open that he is free to receive the ball. That is, a, that is a layer five. And then I didn't want to explain because uh, I want to go to the basics. And basics is uh, pass and cut. That is uh, this back, back, door, back door movement. If you are given uh, to the inside player how you will cut to the basket, that you know reaction of the penetration. That is uh, this cir circle movement. That is uh, baseline penetration. Also is uh, very important that you are know. And then number five is the reaction of the inside player reaction on the penetration. After that, they are coming from an up layer is uh, what I show. They are, they are screen on the ball, they are handoff, that is, uh, that is a cut and after that screen to the player to exchange position. But that is a reaction in between two players, other, other, other players have to follow. Is okay? Iran Jeevi, you can ask a question. Yes. Uh, good evening, sir. Hello? Yeah, yeah, I'm here. Here you are. And then now, then how do you get the defense? Hello? You are not I at all audible. Get... Yeah, yeah. Hello, sir. Can you? Can you? Write, write the question. And then next one.
Hello, Rudra. You can ask your question. Yes, a good evening, coach. Good evening. Actually, I follow this uh, one to six layer. That I, <coughs> what I, what is my doubt is this all layers is useful for man to man and uh, as well as zone defense also. Yeah, yeah. Also, also, Ridriad can play. It's a little bit different. You have a they are okay. called banana banana cut, and then okay. uh, you are never keep the two player inside. On the two okay. movement, they have to be two movement players stay under the basket uh, inside pain, and then after that he is going out. Another player will cut cut to okay. the basket. That is okay. different. But you can okay. find looking looking in uh, internet because uh, Ridriad can play against press. They have a uh -huh. all all opportunity. Lot of team around the world they are play Ridriad on the same way. Lot of NBA uh, NBA team play Ridriad. Too. Okay. So most most effect on uh, man to man defense or zone defense? No, no, no. That is you okay. need to to react. Why okay. call a read and react? You okay, have to okay. read what is in front of you, and then you okay. have to or you have to move to read what okay. is uh, happen. And then when okay. you are when you are develop player to the, this level, they have to react. They will not looking uh, on the defense. What defense play? They immediately they play. But only zone, you have to cut, stay a little bit, ball will move, other will cut. Okay. And then you are going to the another position, another player will cut. Okay. After two, after two pass. Okay. That is different. Okay. Any more questions? Coach, one question: How the post player adjusts the dribbling penetration in layer six? Again, please. How the post player adjusts the dribbling penetration in layer six? And, and I, I say about uh, about you have a three level. You have a three level of the big guy. That is the high post, mid post, and short corner. And depend how is if your penetration coming over the free throw line, over the free throw line. Center will going down. If penetration coming 45 corner down, center will going up. That is a, that is the principle of the big guy. Inside player. Chetanya, you can ask a question. Chetanya. Yeah, please check the message. Can you can you ask the question? Hello. Here you are. You can ask your question. Okay, uncle. Finish. Coach, we are finished. Thank you. Bye-bye.